I do not understand. Does Arasaka not have enough of its own people? Look around, sir. Things are heating up in the city. Zoots know one spark's all it takes for Japan Town to go up in flames. Riots are always best put down by folks not sporting your brand name. Ah, uh, you are here. Why? What are we doing here? You shall learn soon. I acquired some information of my own. Do you know who most wish to honor Arasaka-sama with the parade? Watch yourself! He's a murderer. The irony makes me sick. Still don't see how this gets us anywhere. I have had an idea. Look to the sky. Embarrassing brain dance evidence? The dash floats will pass precisely this way. If I could just get onto Hanako-sama's float, I could speak with her in private. Get there how? Why jump? Of course. Expectations way too high, Goro. Couldn't pull that off even if you still had your fancy implants. I have thought of a solution. While you are occupied with your shady dealings, I learned more about the floats. They are all kept in one place. Arasaka Industrial Park. It is there that they prepare them. We need only to break into the compound, find the right float and inject a virus into its system. You will then be able to disable any security before I sneak inside. Lots of ways to skin this particular cat, you know. Gonna need... I know what you need. It is taken care of. I have an infected shot. It was not cheap, but the man who sold it to me guaranteed it will work. Where'd you get this shard? Across the canal. Kabuki? <laughs> Might actually be half decent soft then. And if it isn't, got a few tricks up my sleeve too. This is good to know. Let us move on. To take control of the float is one thing, but not all. The security concerns me, the snipers especially. I will be an easy target. But I may have an answer. Okada-san mentioned the city cameras. If we gain access to them, we will see exactly where the snipers are. You can deal with them as I advance. Sounds like a plan. You agree just like that? The risks are considerable. Yeah, well, get more and more used to that. And now, what would you say to a small test? We must try the shot. The camera control room is in front of us. You must get inside and infect the network. That is all. Uh-huh. And in the meantime, you'll do what? Crack open a can of suds? I will not touch alcohol. At work. I will watch your back. Now, get to it. worked. And? Done. System's ours. The shot works. Good. The easy work we have done. To break into Arasaka Industrial Park will not be such a bed of roses. But before we discuss that... It. I have not eaten since yesterday. Give me the best on the menu. 
I highly recommend the yakitori today. Anything that isn't local, please. See you tomorrow. I can't believe I'm saying this, but this Sokka scum might actually prove useful. He's a well-trained dog, needs orders, that's all. And when he outlives his purpose, we'll flatline him. He's not on his A-game, sure. But even without implants, he could decommission us easily. Where's that come from? Ever seen him in action? No, just no. And the way he walks, look in his eye. We'll come back to this later. What is this? Hey, Yakitori. Okay, I have laid the plan. One, we break into Arasaka Industrial Park. One and a half, we hack Hanako Sama's float. Two, during the parade, with my help, you eliminate any snipers. Three, I get onto the float. Four, I convince Hanako-sama of the truth. Forgot five. Oda zeroes us and pisses on our corpses. He will never be less than a foot away from Hanako. Oda would not dare raise his hand against me. What about me? That is a different matter. I would advise you to watch your distance. Well, sounds like a suicide run, but done dumber shit than this, so... Things even more stupid than stealing from Arasaka. None dumber yet, no. Set the bar pretty high with that one. Now, we part. Reconnaissance is required. What are you doing? Don't let him off his leash. Let him... You're a stranger in a strange land. I'm going with you. Hmm. True. And you with your hands, skills, mind of a thief. Agreed. This we will do together. Cook! Louder! Louder! I have decided to... Yori no... In the flesh. He eliminated the last obstacle between himself and complete power. They surrendered it to him. Tell me then, what do we call the murder of my father? Was that not a provocation? Was that not a... Arasaka, an empire built to last. Before Yorinobu set fire to it from the inside, all of this began with him. The factions, power struggles, all of this. Ksa! Where's Yorinobu's rebellious streak come from? No one knows this. Perhaps soon I shall ask him in person. Got factions inside Arasaka? What are they? There are three. Kiji, Hato, and Taka. Kiji longs for stability. The old order. They are united behind Hanako-sama. The liberal wing, Hato. Support Michiko-sama. Saburo's granddaughter. I know little about her. And then there is Taka. Treacherous dogs who support Yorinobu. Not to mention even smaller factions. Well, tell me about them some other time. Why'd Saburo tolerate it all? Can't get my head around it. Could've kept his son on a short leash. Arasaka-sama was a strong and disciplined man. The strongest man I have ever known. And yet, at a critical moment, he showed a weakness. For Yorinobu? For his daughter. When Yorinobu formed his band of hounds, declared war on his own family, Arasaka-sama could have crushed him with one word. Yet he did not. 
for he did not wish his daughter to suffer. When Yorinobu returned, his tail between his legs, she persuaded her father to give him a second chance. Do you understand? Hanako-sama saved Yorinobu from the consequences of his deed. There's no time to waste. Wait, you think she's complicit in Saburo's murder? I think we are all to blame. We allowed ourselves to be tricked. But we will correct this soon. Will you join me? Sure, why not? Let us go from here. I hope you enjoyed it. Please come again. So dust and plastic. I have found a good place to observe. We must just climb up here. Fortune smiles to us. It seems no one is here today. I would call this a beautiful view of the city, if... If? If there was anything to admire. Hate Night City that much. Hmm, perhaps I am simply homesick, as you say. Now, you must look for vulnerabilities, weaknesses, while I try to think of a diversion. Arasaka cannot discover our intentions. A bit of sabotage is just what we need to divert their attentions. You will have the best view on the left. I will try here. This old scope should be good for something. Shall we begin? Let's do this. Footbridge, but it's guarded. Transformer by the wall. See it? We should use it to step up. Antenna. Security hub is liable to be in that building. Perfect for sabotage. Camouflage turrets by the gate. A last resort. I do not wish to die there. This is not bad. Pipes. See him? We could use them to get inside. Think I've seen everything. Do you see the three antennas? Perfect for sabotage. Once they lose communications.
混乱するな。So, we going in? Hmm. Is this what you said before entering Kanpeki Plaza? I wish to be certain. We have not overlooked anything. We should wait and observe. If nothing out of the ordinary happens, then yes, we go in. in. Sounds sensible. Better get comfy. <coughs> B. What? What? No sudden movements. Do you see it? That cat? Fine looking feline. Thought they'd all disappeared from the city. It is the first animal I see in Night City, except cockroaches, of course. First it was birds, then dogs. Cats actually put up a fight longest. Perhaps it is a bacchanecho. A bacchanecho? What's that? It is a cat spirit. It brings misfortune. Can restore the dead back to life. Believe in ghosts? The relic lets you talk to the dead, does it not? I believe we are past belief. My grandmother knew many, many stories about Kitsune, Kappa, Bakeneko, too. Where'd you grow up, anyway? I am from the slums of Chiba 11. Once when I was desperate to leave there, I... Ah, bad memories washed away by time. I long only for the simple days of childhood. My childhood? Let's see. Racing my bobber for the first time through the hills. Oh, and, uh, first kiss in the middle of a synth corn field. I remember the chemical stench of the canal, where we boys washed our shirts. Corporate transporters sometimes passed through our slum. Arasaka selecting children but only the clean ones. Let me guess. So they could turn them into Corvo soldiers? Exactly. When they chose me, I felt I had won the lottery. In the army, I was given everything I lacked before. Discipline, regular meals, and when I proved I was gifted, an education. So how's a corpo rookie go from cleaning latrines to being Saburu Arasaka's bodyguard? The highest grades at the academy serves in the special forces, and Arasaka-san has a matched eye for talent. You're not saying Saburo fell for you at first sight. To make the right decisions with imperfect knowledge, that is how you become the world's most powerful man. 100 candidates standing at attention. And Arasaka-sama looked into each of our souls and chose the one who would serve him best. Did what you had to to keep from going hungry. I sense that you judge me, and yet you have no right to. Unlike you and your friend, Mr. Wells, I was not arrogant. I did not take the easy path. Wasn't judging you. And true, you oppose the corporations, their order, their world, in a mindless way, yet you offer no worthy alternative. Take a look around. It's here, your corporate world and its glorious splendor. You show me filthy streets as if no other world exists, 
as if nothing else is possible. What of the millions who work for Arasaka and receive stability? Safety. Cheap 11 slum rats? They're there, scraping scraps out of scop tins. Corpse decided that too. We cannot fix everything at once. You already forget what happened at Tom's diner? People hate corpse more than anything. Can't blame him either. Got some regrets, but clapping from Arasaka ain't one of them. Sometimes I wish to become a nomad, to leave this world, forget everything. Never too late to change. What is your expression? One cannot teach an old dog new tricks. Do you know what I think? What's that? That day in Kompeki, we both have lost someone important. And we are not at peace with this. So we seek conflict, argue eagerly. Finally started to make some sense. There's one thing you should know. It is about Mr. Wells. About Jack? What is it? When I set out to find you, others went to find Jackie. They took his body. For the life of me can't figure why. So his mom couldn't give him a proper send-off? Arasaka has a method for playing information from the dead. What are you talking about? Don't ask for details. I understand little. I know they use the Soul Killer program to do so. They can pull an engram from Wells' body. Damaged. Incomplete. But still an engram. Motherfuckers. Evil. Jackie's psyche. Where are they keeping it? This, I do not know. Why am I only hearing this now? I did not know I could trust you. The circumstances have changed. The Baganenko got sick of us, looks like. It will find its own way. As will we. I think it is time to do something, hmm? Oh, fuck, get worse. You do not look so bad. I'll be in touch. The diversionary action, that is mine to do. I'm in. Good. Now try to enter the warehouse. He's running 
investigate. I will draw their attention away. Had it right. Got an access point to the security systems. Excellent. I am also making progress. We can afford it. Yes. I'm an officer. An officer who works the third guard shift at a warehouse outside town. You'll have to make do. And the children will have to make do with the school. when you step out. Ah, you are... See you now. to go in. Always good here also. I just evaded the patrol. Okay, I'm in. Find the largest float. There. Control 
from inside. That tech, it could be an ordinary terminal. Gotcha. How's things at your end? Good. I will reach the control room and make a terrible mess. Very well. I am ready. When you finish, I'll make the system sick. Floats ours to do with as we please. You can fly to Tokyo if you want. Haha, <laughs> I just may do that. Good work. Now, it is my turn. Can you see? Terrible chaos. Even the roof is a slow... Holy... Me! The roof! That is your will! There are buildings around. Smaller ones. Use them to come down.
fucking worked. Excellent work, B. Okay, what now? Now we retreat into the shadows and arm ourselves with patience. I will contact you before the parade. Until then, try not to get into any more trouble. <laughs> Zeva wasn't in enough already.
Making it worse for yourself. Come out.
only a matter of time. Drop your weapon and drop! Ain't nowhere to hide! So the jack Drop your weapon and show yourself!
rain will soon start. I will wait where we met before. By the stalls. Just stay out of trouble, okay? 